Good morning, you guys. It's Monday. Um, what's today's date? I don't even know what today's date is, but I'm not well at all. Like, I've not been well since Saturday, and I'm currently getting ready for work because this is adulting. No matter how you feel, you have to get ready for work. This is not JHS where you can cry to your mommy and tell your mommy that you don't feel like going to school today. It's very, very different. And I've just been in bed the whole weekend. I've been so sick. It's even funny for me because I don't fall sick. But every month, just because I'm a woman, I fall sick. Like, it happens to me every single month. And it's very tiring and stressful for me. It makes me so sad because I feel very weak and helpless. And, like, I stay in bed the whole time. I don't know. I don't want it to affect my work ethic or whatever. So I have to go to work. It's just, it's just a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> What I was talking about in the previous vlog I got the most exciting news Okay, I got the most exciting news this week Um, okay, let me grab my Was well, just me going back to Nigeria for Spotify because if you are an OG gizzard, you remember the last year for the first time I went on a sponsored trip, a fully paid sponsored trip by Spotify Africa. This year it's happening again, and we are going next week. So this video is just going to be uh, a prep. I know I'm always doing prep, prep, prep. I feel like sometimes I want to do like weekly vlogs. Not sometimes I actually want to do weekly vlogs, but I don't have anything to say. Like, I don't have anything else to do. Like my life is so boring. It's so boring. It's just work, salon, shop. Ah. Oh. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Gisela Gisla Gisla and. Yeah, I have to cover these babies up. Give me a second. As a Gen Z, I like to keep the spirit alive. I'm sorry, I don't iron my clothes. I don't know. It will straighten out by the time I get to the office. It always does. Maybe I should iron this. No, no. The fabric is already textured. So if I iron it, the texture will just leave it. But I will straighten out before I get to the office. The ride will be here in six minutes today. The driver is not going to wait for me. I have to put on some necklace. Yeah, so I've not been able to eat properly like it's so sad living alone is fun until you fall sick and then it's like you miss your mommy like where's your mommy like where's where's my mommy like where's my mom because why am i suffering alone like i couldn't sleep last night i was up the whole evening because i was in pain like <sighs> let me grab my edge control i don't know if you guys know but you can reserve a trip on boat that's what i did last night i think reserving is better because when you reserve the fare is not as high as it usually is because it gives you an estimated fare which is better than the usual fare that you pay on a normal day those of you who are not on boat you can use my code gisela gisela is it gisela 50 i'll put it on the screen and you can use it for the first time and you get like open discount okay like yeah if you haven't used my code before it means you are new here like, are you new here <laughs> so i'm all done now i'm just going to pack my bags and leave because the driver will be here soon and i don't want him outside waiting for me because you people say my driver is always waiting for me like i'm trying to change okay like police <laughs> so let me just do that final outfit my right is like one minute away so i'm quite on time this is my bag this is from lc wakiki this is from mr price lc wakiki my shoes are from some shop on instagram this is basically my look for work today I feel better this morning i hope it stays like this till the end of the day because i'll be damned if i get into bed like i did yesterday i don't want that at all so yes guys let's go to work for the driver actually cancels on me. This is not my driver. This is an actual like driver, random driver I requested. So let's go before he cancels on me, okay? Yeah. Hi guys, good evening. I'm back from work and I am 
literally like so tired I took a shower and then i just sat down to do my skincare because i am going through so much pain that i can't even stand for long do you guys realize that every time i'm about to travel i get my period <laughs> This is the same thing that happened in the Dubai prep vlog and it's happening again in the Lagos prep vlog like Please, if I offended you, I'm sorry. Like, I'm sorry. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Just a little bad bitch that cry like I'm not kill person. I never kill person, please. Where's my mirror? Goodness. Okay. I just feel like I'm supposed to be more excited than I am over this whole Lagos trip thing because if you think about it, I took investing seriously about two years ago. I don't know where these people found me, okay? But Spotify found me last year and last year was my first trip and if you people remember, I was like so gagged, like I was so happy because I was like, why me? Like how did you guys find me? Like I was so shook, like I was like, is this really happening and then it's happening again this year and i know i'm supposed to be like oh my god lagos like oh my god spotify i feel like that but because of how i'm feeling right now it's like can't seem to uh, bombard you guys with like the excitement and the happiness and you guys know how i like screaming over nothing and like all of that like i just can't bring myself to do that like i feel overwhelmed right now and even as i'm talking i feel like i'm going to cry because my abdomen is killing me anyway so uh, i'm going to use this lip mask from brielle cosmetics this is from brielle cosmetics if you're on my instagram you've probably seen me using their mirror lip liners and their lip glosses and she sent me this and the lip scrub it's in my bathroom i wish i could go bring it but you guys i'm dying like i literally can't bring it so this is what it looks like it smells so good this is the lip mask and i use this every evening before i go to bed it's so good like it smells amazing and then i wake up feeling so good you know how you wake up and sometimes your lips are like chapped and like very rough and uh-uh that doesn't happen in this house like it doesn't happen in my house i don't experience that because of this product like it's so good i literally never go at night without it like, oh and it smells so good like it smells so nice it smells like yogurt you know the the yogurt from fana is here it smells exactly like that it smells amazing as i was saying as an influencer yeah, getting a fully sponsored trip where like they cater for your flight they cater for your hotel they cater for your food like they cater for every single thing is a big deal even if you are going to togo even if you are going to kumasi like it's a very very big deal no offense but i'm just like trying to use the proximity as an example it's a very very big deal the first time i went there it was just a 24 hour trip I like i was like oh my god wow wow but this time it's a four day trip four days like four days you know sometimes i just sit down and i think to myself and i feel like i'm not doing too well as an influencer and i just i don't know i just sometimes feel like i'm not doing enough i can do better than i'm doing right now but i usually feel so overwhelmed with like work and my my life like adulting and everything sometimes i'm just like i wish i could do better i, I watch these influencers outside and i'm like oh my god this could be me but i'm just here in ghana and then i'm just struggling to be uh, one of the best and it's hard it's like really really hard because sometimes i think to myself and i'm like i'm just not doing enough and that's exactly how i was feeling before the spotify thing came and then i was just there and then this thing like just came through my mirror. i was like wait hold up i thought it was like a one-time thing but it's happening again and i'm just so thankful i'm so grateful and i i don't know i just it makes me feel good about myself it makes me feel like people actually see the work i'm doing and they appreciate like what i'm doing they appreciate me they acknowledge me as an influencer and the thing is we did an afrobeat campaign journey of a billion streams on my it's on my instagram and the other influencers the south african influencers and nigerian influencers like it was all over like our social media accounts and after that this is like a continuation of it so it's like maybe they actually did like my work they did like my work so i was like okay like it's not so bad she said that maybe actually going somewhere like actually doing something for yourself and i always feel like this when i'm on my period i don't know where it comes from but I, all of a sudden i feel like i'm um, some piece of shit like i'm not doing anything with my life and even when i do something with my life it keeps coming back to me and it's like nah girl you couldn't have done that like imposter syndrome like it's so crazy like it has me by the neck literally like strangling me to death i feel like i'm blabbering but all i'm trying to say is that i'm really grateful and i'm thankful and i know i'm supposed to be 
more excited than i am right now but i really am i just can't express it the way you people would expect me to express it because of how you people know me to be and to be very honest i'm overwhelmed and i still can't believe it like it's so surreal it's like it's um, like i can't believe that it's happening I don't know, it's a big deal to me it's a very very big deal to me They're trying to like explore lagos a bit more because lagos is actually fun the last time i went there was like crazy it was super fun so going back it's just like top top for me nigeria is a place that i would never ever say no to if you want me to go to nigeria 10 times in a year i will go so if you need my details dm me and i'll give it to you so you can book me a flight or something yeah <laughs> i didn't realize this thing was blocking your view oh my god Oh, I've started Arrow. I like it. I, I think it's good. It's good. It's not so bad. I remember one of my friends used to talk about it a lot. And then yesterday I saw it on my Netflix and I was like, oh, why not? I'm going to try it. And it's not so bad. So I'm going to continue watching that and then probably fall asleep. And as you guys can see, my lashes are like falling out. I look so... It's not giving. It's not giving spicy because I'm going to have to work on these this week. And then I don't know. Whatever comes up, that's why it's a vlog. And I hope you guys stay tuned to the end. I'm also going to tell you guys that I have had a rude awakening. And I was just thinking to myself that I want to be a consistent YouTuber. So if you will keep getting notifications that I'm posting vlogs, don't even, like, don't even, oh, Giselle Accra, ah, just, just tap and watch. Like, just, just tap and watch. Like, just tap and watch it. Okay, just tap. Don't, don't, don't even, like, just tap it. And watch it and that's all period anywho i'll talk to you guys tomorrow and yeah good night guys bye oh my god hi you guys i feel like my life is a mess i'm literally miserable right now because it's 11 a.m i've been in bed since nine i woke up at nine i thought my deadline was thursday for this content i have to create but apparently it's today and i have like no idea what i'm going to do i have no idea what i'm about <laughs> It's raining outside, like it's been raining since I woke up and I've just been trying to think of how to go about this thing, this video that I have to create for Spotify today. And by the time you guys watch this vlog, I would have posted it already. It's basically a site that gives you like a whole ass like, playlist of old songs that, you know, will just make you feel like you want to go back in time and sweet mommies and sweet puppies watching this video even those of you born in the 2000s i'm sure you guys can relate like, to most of these songs and they also have like puzzles they have like, games anything you want to know about the history and the origins of afrobeats it's on my website it's linked in my description box and you guys can tap on it to check it out so you're supposed to create content around that for instagram you know it's easy to do it on youtube because I'm, i just spoke about it but on instagram baby like i just have to like, push everything into a few seconds and post it and i was thinking of like doing a uh, self-care because already i think i actually do need the self-care i'm going to fix my lashes this weekend and my hair next week so i have to do a little bit of self-care before i go and get all of these things done so my skin can like you know glow because my skin looks dry as hell like i look so dry oh my god i don't have this facial razor thing so i just ordered one and some other stuff for the video because i don't have those things here at home all of them are out of so again, I'm not a skincare girly, I'm not even going to lie. I just use my black suit and I'm good to go. But this time, I need, like, you know, because it's content, like, I need stuff in the video. These are the things we go through as content creators, guys. Like, I literally had to spend out of my budget this morning to make the video work because I can't do it get ready with me. I'll be wasting products. I don't have anywhere to go. My lashes are off. I look very, very hideous. My hair is less. And I don't know how else to go about this video, but this is the only idea I have, so I'm going to just run with it. I usually plan my content the night before, so I'm not confusing the one like I am right now, but because I thought my deadline was on Thursday, did other things this week, and now I am supposed to produce the content today. Hmm. Anywho, so I'm not even eating. I checked my fridge and I have only one egg left. One egg. One. I feel a lot better today actually i feel better i still am feeling pains but emotionally and physically i feel better i just have like a little pain going on here also this is the lip mask i couldn't show you guys yesterday i didn't even leave my bed <laughs> my bed is even messy like, guys i'm sorry this is a messy vlog i'm so sorry like i just hope like i'm so sorry i am so stressed i'm all over the place i'm so sorry you yeah, are going to have to deal with all of this mess in my videos i'm really sorry this is the lip scrub i was talking about yesterday and then this is what it looks like it actually smells like the lip mask as well and i'm going to use this too because i've not scrubbed in a while like 
And so, guys, <sighs> I feel so stressed. Let me just like go to the kitchen and see if I can find something to eat. Even though that is not the most feasible option right now, but let's see what we can have. As I said, I opened my fridge and I just had one egg. Kusiabak. Let me show you guys. It's so bad. Like, it's even embarrassing. Like, where is it? I'm going to wait for the driver to come. There are no lights waiting. Another joy of living alone. I can literally like, drink from the bottle and nobody's going to check me. Like, who's going to check me, bro? <laughs> just waiting for the driver to come so we can film for Instagram. I'm going to take a shower. I'm actually going to take a shower now. Yes, I'm going to take a shower now and film for Instagram when the driver comes. So I'll catch you guys later. you guys i honestly feel like forces are working against me now because i was just about to start filming and i've been in bed for the past hour because my abdomen is killing me and on top of that yeah let me show you guys something <laughs> so i place my ring lights on top of my wardrobe so i can like have the light bounce on the ceiling and you know make the lighting better in the room and it's like connected to this right here and for some reason it has stopped working <laughs> just like that my deadline is at 12 and it's already 12 or 1 i've not filmed nothing i'm in bed sick as hell Let me figure it out and then, like, yeah. You know what? I'm not going to let my crumb stop me. I have to find an extension board to film before, like, I can't miss my deadline. And I don't know where I'm even going to find some to buy, like, guys. Wow, what a stressful weekend. Okay, you, let's just, like, let's go and scout the area. Maybe we'll find something. Let's just, let's just see. I feel so crazy. There's this shop at the junction. I'm going to check if they have it. If they do, sure. If they don't, just going to call. Ah, my keys. This is my then how they're jiggling to the baby. I don't have friends in my area. This is why I need to make more friends in my area. Because what? You know, let's just go. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. Good afternoon. Hello. Um, metal extension board. Okay. Um, thank you. Thank you very much. Oh my god, you guys, it's raining. <laughs> I feel so silly. It's raining and I got the extension board. I had no idea extension boards were like 70 CDs. I have to like run. I can't run because the other one is killing me. But it's a good thing that we got the extension here. I'm going to do this Instagram video like real quick so I can like submit it. I've not even eaten. And it's like almost 1 p.m. Please. Let me just get home real quick. People are starting to look at me like I'm crazy. Today drained me and it's just 1 p.m. Oh my god.
so now that I'm done taking a shower, I didn't touch my face when I was bathing because of the skincare video. And I don't want to wash my face twice, it's not good. Is it though? Girl, I have no idea. I just know I don't have to do it. Anyway, so my hair is a mess. You know, Instagram is all about glam. I can be my real self with you guys on YouTube. But Instagram, it's like packaging more cacarate, yes, yeah, yeah. I'm going to brush this out, put on some headband, and get right into the video. I look so crazy. Oh my god. Let me grab my hairbrush right now. Okay. These bundles are so good, you guys. Like sometimes when I bath, as you can see, it's damp on this side. It's really, really damp, like on this side. Because the water touches it when I'm taking a shower, even though I wear my bonnet on it. But it's still more hard. Like some of these waves are so high that even when the wind is blowing, even if you go and stand by the sea, if you go to Labadi and you stand by the sea and the wind is blowing, the hair will not move. But this one. If somebody's angry and the person is yelling next to you, it will, it will just like, like, are you mad? Are you mad? Are you out of your mind? Like, you know, those little, little air from the, the, the speech will even be blowing the hair. In fact, let me just take this to where I'm filming the Instagram video so, you know, it can be easy for all of us. Maybe here? I don't know. Let me try it. If I had a middle part, all I would have to do is wear this and pull it back. But because I have the side part, I'm not so sure how I'm even making it work. Like, <laughs> just let me fuck it for real. Like, let me see how it will work if I put it on it. all of this for instagram like goodness i'm still mad i bought this robe in a smaller size like what the hell i can't even raise my arm <laughs> robe naomi if you got this please. oh this is what i bought by the way i bought these razors that's my twitter and somebody suggested this shop luckily for me it was like right across mostly across the street but like it's really close to me but I, i'm so particular about like aesthetics and stuff i wish i had a white hair clip because this is red what do you mean red Guys, does this make sense? I feel crazy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Twist it. Like, clip it up. From Shein. Oh. If I look normal, I, st I don't feel normal. <laughs> does this look okay, guys? Do I look crazy? Hmm. I don't know. You know what? I think I'm not really seeing the vision, but I'll try filming on Instagram to see how it looks and maybe then we can have a conversation. Also, because of how tight this small ass robe is, I'm going to wear something inside and like, you know, open it up because I'm suffering. Like, I can't even breathe in this. I look like I'm going to play. What's anyone that thing? Like, you know, the um, is it golf or whatever. It looks like I'm going to play. <laughs> I'm going to have to leave you guys for a bit. I'll be back. Of course, I'll be back. Like, you guys are my day ones. I'll be back. Okay, I'm going to film something for Instagram and I'm gonna be back. Let me grab a glass, pour some juice in it, and pretend as if I'm drinking wine. I can't drink wine. I don't like alcohol. I have like a bunch of wine in my kitchen and in my fridge. I'm trying to stop drinking alcohol because it's not nice. It's alcohol is not nice. That's the only reason why I'm trying to stop. It's not nice. I only take it when like it's crucial like when i'm out and i'm trying to be late but normally when i'm at home why like why would i drink alcohol when i'm at home it doesn't even make sense to me like you're at home when nothing is wrong with you like you're at home in the comfort of your bed and your space and you're drinking alcohol like bffr i'm not judging you i'm not judging you okay <laughs> i'm not judging you i call this nasty sometimes but and yet they, it makes me nauseous oh my god when i was in uni i used to drink yeah now that i have the freedom and justice i can't drink so there's that too let me pour myself some glass and start filming okay her
making fries and chicken basically this is just secrets of adam or secrets of eden or whatever i have juice i bought the last time somebody corrected me in the comments the last time i really appreciate it because i genuinely thought it was apple juice it tastes amazing i've already made the fries i have some recipe i got online i'm using emboc fries so i basically boil it for like two to three minutes and then put some cold water on it right after i take it off the fire just like you're making spaghetti and then put a little bit of corn starch this is the corn flour oh corn starch i use i got this from Shoprite. yeah pour a little bit of this on it and then i put it back into the fridge for like some 10 to 12 minutes and then i fry it and guys like when i tell you it's the crazy crunchy please don't play with it i'm going to steam my chicken now i feel like i'm always ranting to you guys but let's be serious i feel like Ghanaian services are not serious <laughs> like i'm not going to mention names because even even the last time i spoke about the bank thing i walked into the bank and i was going to withdraw my money the honest truth is i genuinely forgot to, to change my account for my salary so the payments we made for last month it went back into this account so i went to the bank and i'm like hi i'm trying to take my money from the account and the lady who was trying to like help me the teller was like oh was this the bank you're complaining about i was like girl <laughs> look i didn't know you watch my youtube and i didn't know i was going to encounter that at the bank but believe me i was so shy like i was so shy in my head i was like oh my god no please why why does this have to happen to me but think about it why are Ghanaian services always stressing women like are you like is it is it misogyny like what is it because tell me why i have paid for internet because my internet at home is so bad like it's terrible so i paid for internet from another network service provider on thursday and they said oh madam please will come and do it for you on saturday or friday i'm like oh no problem you guys can even come on saturday because i'm busy on friday now i'm home the whole day no contact no message i'm like are you people for real like are you for real and then i called the lady the customer service agent who was trying to like helping me get the thing and she didn't pick up on saturday so on monday i texted and i was like madam hey i mean i'm moving video was it me that people are trying to play with like please come on i don't play like that like why isn't anybody calling me perfect i thought you people said you come and install the internet for me on saturday or friday but you couldn't show up no call no message like no sense of urgency are you people serious and she's like oh they'll come and do it today today's tuesday today is tuesday no call no text i'm like bro why like it's not like i've no paid though and when i contacted them for the internet i'm not the one who contacted them and then they called me and they're like oh they're going to come and install my internet for me that i have to pay this amount of money i'm like oh no problem because i'm getting the fiber and then i go ahead from them again now that's fine that's fine every day comes with its own lesson every day comes with its own lesson why who should keep playing with me like that anyway i'm going to see my chicken now so i just have garlic ginger onion the spice and some salt i'm going to steam this for a while before i fry it up i'm using my little gas here and the gas is like it's huffing and puffing like a fucking dragon and yeah i actually do need to get to school <laughs> but i know i'm not going to do that until i move out of this yeah <laughs> it's hot 
o'clock okay it's all o'clock you guys i'm so excited like i'm so happy today because i'm having a good day like i'm having a great day <laughs> so i'm going to fix my lashes got my nails done passed by mr price and lc wakiki to get some stuff and i ordered some things from plt boohoo and amazon through rosé this week actually and everything arrived today like do you understand do you understand like i ordered everything through him i just sent him the links to everything i needed from the site he ordered them and shipped them for me everything was shipped this week to the point where we even shipped some things from amazon like yesterday or two nights ago so pause awards is tomorrow today is friday so pause awards is tomorrow and i didn't know until thursday when somebody from pause texted me because in my mind pause awards is like later this month like gisela <laughs> i had no dress no plans of like finding an mua my hair like girl so when she texted me i was like you know what it's fine cool <laughs> So I texted Nadu, the lady who makes my clothes for me, and then we found a list to sew some outfits. So this is the inspiration for the outfit. Hair and makeup, I have no idea. Nadi does my makeup all the time, and she's so good at it. Like, I don't have to tell her what to do. She will know exactly how to kill it for me tomorrow. And my hair, I texted flare hair, and of course, you know, they, I'm their girl. They be like, come on, don't play with it. <laughs> So everything is in place now and we are ready for Paul's Awards tomorrow. I'm just hoping the outfit turns out like I, I, I'm imagining right now because we didn't get the exact list we wanted. So we had to improvise. Like the exact list was like 2,200 in this economy. Please, I don't play like that. <laughs> anyway, anyway, you guys, let's get into this big ass haul, okay? So these things are from PLT and um, LC Wakiki. So let's get into these things first. We have, um, oh, this is my outfit for Lagos, and, and mm -mm. I don't want you guys to see this outfit, so let me just put it somewhere. <laughs> Isn't why it's a vlog, so you will see it in the next vlog, okay? So you have to just stay tuned, baby. <laughs> that outfit made me so happy, like, I, it made me so happy because I wasn't sure of the size I was ordering, but when I ordered it, it came perfectly. <laughs> I tried it on to the end. <laughs> That was scary. <laughs> and that outfit is from Jaded London. It's not from people and stuff, right? And so I got some cute nightwears because I can't find my nightwear. You know, I bought the one in blue and pink, the one uh, Mathilde and I were twinning in at the tag <laughs> event. Yes, yeah, so when I went to Mr. Price, they had like these cute nightwear. So I bought this one they were in two colors this and then it also came in black so it's just like a pj like a short pj i got mine in a size s because i think for the night they make it in bigger sizes so i got this in a size small and the black one also got this in a size small because when i tried the medium it was too big for me so black and this color i don't know if it's, it's giving peach it's giving pink so i just bought it either way i feel like if you're looking for nightwear to buy it's mr price no doubt about it i also bought these shorts for the airports because hmm, i ordered from Shein for this trip what's outfits but i don't think it will come on time so i'm trying my best to improvise i don't want to be stressed so the good girl that i am walked into mr price today and picked out these shorts for the airport because i have no joggers like apart from I, don't, I barely have joggers so i just bought this and i'll find a nice top to just like a nice basic top to wear it with it and I think it will go, yeah. So let's go to these Opoly outfits. Okay, so I wanted to show you guys these outfits as well. I bought this particular one from Opoly for my birthday because I wanted to go for dinner night of my birthday, but I wasn't feeling like it anymore and plans change, da, da, da. And I really wanted this outfit so bad. If you guys remember, I wanted the long sleeve version for Dubai, but I couldn't get it. So I got the short one. And it's so pretty i can't wait to wear it it looks the same as it is on the side the same thing it's the same thing as it is on the side i got the skirt in a size 8 and i got the top in a size 8 as well i also got this from an instagram vendor she's called i don't remember but i'll touch it to the video and she just like sent this for an ad 
in Lagos and this is so pretty actually I was made to choose an outfit so I chose this one because I thought the pants would look so fine on me you know? my ass is coming to be very honest I've gained weight I've gained so much weight that thickums is an understatement like it's giving cute to bolo like I am a bolo but shy do you understand yeah the pants are also very very heavy don't let it like anyone deceive you so if you're looking for opoli outfits to buy you can text this lady and she'll have it delivered to you as soon as possible because when i told her i needed the outfits for lagos or if she would want it to be featured in the lagos vlog it didn't take long and she just ordered it and sent it to me i'm like girl i know that's right <laughs> so i'm so happy about this i'm really really happy about this because i am so indecisive that i kept sending an order every single day and it was still delivered to me <laughs> can you guys imagine <laughs> they bought it this evening actually like i know oh my god the things are a lot i want to cry oh my god <laughs> these are the things so as i said we have plt boohoo Oh, I think they took them out to check it out. And then PLT. These are from Google. Oh god, they are a lot. And some things from Amazon. I'm not even going to play with you guys. If you are looking for things to buy from Amazon, it's rose you have to text. Okay, it's rose you have to text literally because these things came and they, they came really well. Like so let's start with this little box right here i got some earrings from amazon i've been seeing alia's face white and i'm like hmm actually the original ones are from bottega but i can't afford bottega so i got the deep from amazon and oh my god it's it ah! wow wow and they spoil them they really spoil them they really really spoil them oh my god and i also got these shoes from amazon I needed something to go with my outfit, the one I'm hiding from you guys. <laughs> I needed silver shoes and I don't have those silver shoes, so I got these from Amazon. I saw a lady wear it on TikTok and then she linked it, so I searched for it and I found it and I think it looks very, very pretty. I got mine in the size 8. Ah, US size 8. Is it US? I think so. Maybe I mean, but damn, it eats, okay? And the clothes, so this what's this uh, this is a hey size 12 jesus hey ready <laughs> size 12 oh my god this is a size 12 this is a plt scale i'm a size 8 so i don't know if this will fit okay okay but we'll see about it We'll see about it. We'll see about it. Okay, you guys, so my story was full. I had to clear it a bit. Bad news is that all of the PLT things and the boo things are not my size. They are bigger than me. And I'm not going to lie, I've cried. <laughs> I just finished crying and I had to film this because I don't know how else to end this part of the video. But this has really made me sad because my trip is on Wednesday. Today is Friday. And uh, Rose has assured me that he's going to ship them all over again for me. So I don't have to pay for these ones, but the next one's coming. And I don't know how to feel because I don't know if I'm going to get the outfits, especially one jumpsuit in it that I need for the trip. So I don't know how to feel about it. I'm really sad right now, but that's just for another day. So all of these things, the problem was we used the US site to, to shop. And we use UK sizes. So, you know, US sizes are smaller than UK sizes. So, when I ordered them in UK size 8, it came as US size 10. It, US size, yeah, they gave us their US sizes. I don't know if I'm making sense. Instead of using US sizes, we used UK sizes. So, I got bigger, bigger sizes. I just wanted to show you guys some things I got for the Pulse Awards. So, for the inspo for the Pulse Awards, I needed a shawl or whatever it's called. I couldn't find some. I knew I wouldn't find some in Ghana for a craft. So we bought one from Amazon. And this is what it looks like. I'm not going to lie. It looks like, you know, those fair carpets. 
so you know it's supposed to be like this but i am going to wear it like this like this so it gives luxury and comfort yeah but this came and i'm glad this came because i actually do need it tomorrow and my outfit is all black so this works perfectly well and i think it came with something else I'm not sure what this is but let's see i don't remember ordering anything else oh the headpiece because the theme for the event is great gatsby so i remember i i got the headpiece i don't think i'm going to wear it because Ghanaians we don't follow things <laughs> and this has blue in it so i'm not sure yeah this has like a blue feather type thing it's supposed to be like this because we're in 20 so like this but i don't think i'll wear this tomorrow though i don't know i don't think i'll wear it it's really really cute though hello guys good morning it's 11 a.m oh today is the pulse awards and i am going to create content for this shop at east Legon. i woke up around like 8 a.m but i've been in bed since I'm using these two perfumes zara hibiscus and then Brazilian crush yeah I got this top from Ali is it Aliexpress or Shein I got this this top from Shein my shorts from Denim from Nan and I thrifted this bag from Shofuga Finds on Instagram it's so cute and yeah <laughs> my eyes are so red I don't know if you guys can see it I don't know why I got like a bad cold last night and I don't know if you can hear from my voice but yeah like it's still there I'll go to the salon flare hair because I have to go and style my hair Maddie is coming back this evening to do my makeup I don't know if she's coming here I'll have to go to her but now is doing my makeup tonight I still haven't seen my dress and uh yeah i think that's about it i have to get going because i'm actually late i told him i'll be there at 11 and it's 11 12 right now and i have to rush to east Legon. and also i'm meeting my cousin today i'm meeting Eden today because i asked her for her camera for lagos because my phone is just a mess like the storage is always full so i need something that wouldn't stop my enjoyment or my drip i don't like that i want to be doing tiktok content and youtube content and instagram content so the camera would actually really help me and so yeah let's go guys Hi guys, so I'm at my ad location now. This is Maureen. <laughs> That's Maureen. <laughs> so Maureen owns a salon at Okunglo, right? Mm -hmm. It's called Winnie's Femilax. Mm -hmm. I ran an ad for hair like is it two years ago or last year? Last year. Yeah, last year. The first time I tried corn roses at hair salon and I loved, loved it. So they have like this boutique now and I'm here to create content for TikTok and Instagram. And this place is so beautiful. Let me show you guys. This place is at, um, what's the location? Is this East Legon or Madina? East Legon. This is East Legon. Baaleshi Road. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's called PNS. I think it's on the PNS Plaza. Mm -hmm. And the shop is called Nabils. Mm -hmm. Yes. So let me show you guys. Let me give you guys a sneak peek of this place. Okay, before I start filming for Instagram because the place is so beautiful. Let me just show you guys. I'm letting God handle all things above me. The things I can't change are the reason you love me. Listen, you can hear the call in my name. Oh my god, this is wow, this is so pretty. Like, still finding myself letting love. It's a side bag. Feel like we wanted to say my relationship changed. Now I'm getting every chance. Guys, I'm finally done. It's 2 p.m. and I'm done. I'm going to the salon to get my hair done. I've seen the outfit and it's not so bad actually, but I want to see it in person first. So, I'm going to get my hair styled. Then now we'll do my makeup and I'll keep you guys updated. But now I'm done. So, Maureen, you want to say hi? Bye. You already said hi, so you can say bye to them. Bye. <laughs> bye, guys. You guys, some of these people I work with, they are super nice. So Maureen, the owner of the shop, right? She asked their driver to use her car to drop me off at the salon. Can you imagine? That's like, 
oh my god somebody like this if i'm working for her i will give her a crazy discount and she also bought food from just chinese and her driver is going to pick it up from me. he's coming now so i have to stop recording i'm shy Fellas, I'm at Flair Hair right now. I'm coming to eat. Lena is not out of town, so her girls are going to do my hair for me. My eyes are still red. Oh my god. Her camera, you guys, because Gisela said she wants to use a camera in Lagos, so she brought me her camera and the charger and everything. I actually can't wait to buy a camera, like, I have been wanting a camera for like two years. Look, I don't care how long it takes, I'm going to get a camera. Please, okay, please. But this is amazing, it's perfect. Ah, uh, it's not even really shiny. I okay. want a shiny bag. Yeah, that's what I'm saying that the one I have that is shiny is red. Oh, I want <laughs> I know even to is anybody at home to use an Uber? Uber? Oh you mean no you do you, you now if you think who is at home at this time? Yeah. But today is Saturday. We go, we go to work on Saturday. So they are not going home early to this stuff nice and going. I'll be nice in Sunday with mommy. Damn. Oh god, I really don't have a bag for I I've been thinking of outfits, outfits, outfits. I don't have a bag. Let me see if I already find it. My outfit right is lace and then I'm using a fair shawl. Do you think if I use satin gloves it will work? Not satin like paradise, you know that, that fabric. Uh, if I use the gloves for that for that for the gloves to the work. You have to wear it and see first. The dress is lace so yeah, this is like a my head. I bought these earrings from Amazon. Oh yeah. no, it's not the same thing. No, Mine is that. Have you seen the one that Leah face wears? Yeah. The teardrop. Yeah. yeah, I bought some from Amazon. The Bottega. Yeah. yeah. No, this one is. Um, I stole it from Amazon. Uh, oh, case. so will you will you check the bag for me? Yeah. You said you are going to check some bag. Some bag you took to some place. No, this is the bag. I'll just show you the red one. See if you want it. My dress is black. Why else do I want to be black and red? The, the event is black and gold. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't have the. Let me see. I don't have the red in my seat. I don't even know if I have any habit. I don't know how you. A gold clutch? Yeah, but it, it doesn't look. Anyway, guys, this is the one I'm talking to. So you don't think I'm talking to a host? So I'm going to Nadi's place for the makeup now. I've been home for like an hour, but I was trying to transfer things from my phone to my laptop so I can have space to film. So my ride is six minutes away and I'm still wearing yesterday's pants. Yeah, and then this top I thrifted from, I don't know where. So let me show you guys something. I showed you guys the shawl yesterday. Yeah, and then these beads i don't know how i'm going to even wear them but for my outfits i have to wear something underneath it because it's too transparent so i'm going to wear my skims this skims 
underwear is so like it's such a convenience because my outfit is super transparent so if i don't wear this guys everybody will see my ass and it matches my skin so bad that it's perfect okay to be fair i don't know the makeup is what i'm going for the makeup look i'm going for i'll know when i get to know this piece but i want something bold i want like a red lip type thing dark eyes because my outfit is black and my outfit is very basic so my makeup my hair and my accessories must like you know amplify the look that's what i'm thinking so i am just going to get that done and the theme is bold and elegant gold and black i didn't know that the emphasis was on the gold because on the flyer i don't know plus they said great gatsby so in my mind great gatsby was what i had until i realized bold is the actual theme so i'm not doing anything gold it's just black anyway so yeah so let's go to now this face to get this face beat her i'm here now you guys this is another reason why you should book now this you must handle yeah just say and you can teach you to me now where you want her to and I want so candles, yes. <laughs> That's Frank Lina, you guys. Yeah. Why the blue? You've not used it before. I don't even know. Like, look at you guys. My eyes are so red. They'll think they'll think I'm in an abusive relationship. Now it's going to put natural tears or whatever in my eye to see if it will lessen the effect. I don't know why. Yesterday I was sneezing, sneezing, sneezing. Oh, no, nothing to your allergies. Maybe your allergies be there. You come. Two, two, two. A bad day, a bad chance, Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I actually needed to go before Nigeria. And you said you've been sneezing. Yeah. Maybe I am a different. Allergies, they say a white people thing. And also, you know, for any allergies. Yes, you know, we are strong. I prayed for premium treatment. I didn't pay for this. You prayed. I prayed. You I I am I'm done with my makeup now. I'm really sad because my eyes are still red and then my dress is not here. It's almost 8.30 and the dispatch rider is not even picking up my call. So I don't even know if I should wait here or go home. So, I don't know. I don't know. I'll just keep you guys posted. Okay. Yeah, it's corny with the Illuminati mess. Paparazzi catch my fly and my cocky fresh. I'm so reckless when I rock my Givenchy dress. I'm so possessive, so I rock his rock necklaces. My daddy, Alabama. Mama, Louisiana. You mix that Negro with that Creole, make the Texas Bama. outfit check before i go i'll talk to you guys on my way to the page because i'm so late so this scarf this is a scarf that i made into a top it's from amazon and my skirt is from pretty little thing in a size 12 but i think it fits okay and my telfa and my oh my bottega dupe earrings and this necklace is from shein i think yes so yeah Princess is having a cocktail making class today and I'm so late so I think I'll just go and then talk to you guys in the car about like the post event yesterday. My driver is here so bye. I almost forgot to mention my shoes. These shoes are from Tag Ghana. The same shoes um, I got from the Tag event. Yeah, same thing. So yeah, this is my outfit for the day and I have to go. Oh yeah. My makeup looks nice. Oh, <laughs> uh, 
so I'm um, I'm at the place now. Princess is outside waiting for everybody to come because there's no sign or signage to show that Hana Yebo is a Hana Yefo is a Hana Yefo. So Princess is here and the post event yesterday, like Princess won for our award no way. And she has broken one. And it fell from it hasn't even been 24 hours yet. Where is it at? <laughs> this is the award Princess won. As you can see, it's broken. But she won the YouTube Influencer of the Year and what else? Instagram. An Instagram Influencer of the Year. Yeah. And the best dress. And, and I, you know, I actually broke it myself so that we share. Ah! <laughs> so I should go and put this out. <laughs> you are so silly. <laughs> <laughs> so me and princess we got them it's like probably blue as all the year i'm all taking right. this home princess is not serious <laughs> hey, but the event was no. okay it was it yeah. was it was i think it was good and i'm so upset this morning because you people know i wore my schemes under my outfit and like it's not showing like my body so the schemes material matches my skin perfectly like same shade it's sold out on the site but i posted it on my instagram about months ago when i started working with schemes and it's all over twitter that i was naked and i'm so upset because why are Ghanaians like that i feel like every time i wear I wear things because I want to wear them. I'm not trying to please any of you or anybody. Like I wear things because that's my style. So if I've been able to figure out my my style, now me shout tie now to feel wear food. Then there's a way jar, way jar like wear food. Why is Gisela wearing this? You don't know me from anywhere. You don't know me. You don't know. You only know me on social media. Why you going? Three minutes. What's they going on then? Do, they want to do an interview with mm. me, endurance and Seeker official, mm. at 8.30. Tonight. <laughs> Tomorrow. Uh, in the morning. Maybe you can go. It's close to your house, or? Yeah, but 8.30, what time will I do my I makeup? And wake up early. Wake up at 6. I wake up early nowadays. I wake up at 7. Now, but my body doesn't stand up for the day. Yeah. It's just it's that I'm dead. So wake yes. up at 6. Tomorrow. But I don't drink alcohol but too. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, this is an oppo, I see being. like two people to come here. Somebody said she, she has been wanting to learn how to make up things. I have always Oh, <laughs> 
I'm a bloody girl, 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 I'm a bloody girl,